I see adventure. Find Daniel san on quest to save Weir from wrath of ruthless captain. Will he sink or swim? strong men, not two men and a girl. I don't care. I didn't come all the way to Norway to wait at the hotel while you and Mr. Miyagi go sailing off to look for the shrine. But you'll spoil everything if you show up there with us. I will not. You will too. Oh. 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 Mr. Miyagi! Daniel-san and Taki-san need to take deep breath. <laughs> <laughs> I remember, only important that we find shrine not who finds it. I guess you're right. Do you really think the whale that attacked these ships could have swallowed the shrine? Could be. Whale only attack illegal whaling boats. Maybe shrine increase instinct for survival. Well, what do we do if we find her? First get job on fishing boat going near sightings. Then worry about whale. Well, bon voyage! Lars! Olaf! What's taking you so long loading the trains? They're doing the best we can, Captain! I give up! We need a new winch! First mate, get over there and show those swabs their left hand from their right. Yes, sir. on the first three able-bodied men that answered that ad. Permission to come aboard, sir. Hold it right there. I don't care if I am in a hurry. I ain't running no floating kindergarten for the likes of you. Or no old folks home for the likes of you, neither. And there's not even three of you. Yes, there are, sir. When I need your help, I'll ask for it. Your girl! I mean, your girl! 
fly. It uh, looks like this boat ride is going to be a lot more fun than I thought. Thanks for saving my daughter. I guess I could find some use for you. But I don't know about your mates. Friends, good workers. Run quick. Yes, I will see. So, uh, you're the captain's daughter? Yeah. You want to make something of it? No, no. It's just a pleasant surprise. You won't think it's so pleasant by the time this voyage is over. Got your mind on your work, Sigrid. Yes, father. I want to cast off without any more delay. Did I say fun? This is not exactly what I had in mind, either. Hey, cool it, talk. <laughs> no, you cool it, Daniel-san. You're in the same boat now. Yeah, I know. But whatever happened to the romance of the sea I'm always reading about? Hey, may I uh, help you with your groceries, fair maiden? No. <laughs> Maybe I'll better luck in pressing guard if stop trying so hard. Forget it, Mr. Miyagi. This girl is a walking iceberg. As father once said, Need to look below tip of iceberg to see what underneath. If you're through playing search and rescue, I've got work for you, Swabs. <sighs> nothing under this iceberg but more ice. <clears throat> Here, store the rest of these food supplies in the galley. Ah! <sighs> Whatever happened to real men? Well, well, well. Who do we have here? <laughs> I should never have hired the lot of you. The last thing I need on my boat is a female. But she's a female. That's different. She's not useless. I can do any chore you assign me, Captain Olsen. So you will, girl. Now in the galley with you. But, but... Captain! There she blows! What? Hurry! Break open the crates! Hey, what's going on? Did, did he set a school of fish? You do as you're told, crewman! No! What's that thing? Just what it looks like, a whale harpoon! But I thought this was a fishing boat! Not on this trip. There's a reward on that whale's head, and I intend to get it. Captain! She's diving! She's getting away! I want that harpoon mounted on the railing! Now! That's an order! Go on, girl. Get out of here! She's gone! Olaf, prepare the harpoon! We're going after her! Like I said, you aren't fit for life on the sea! If destroying that whale is what it takes to be fit, then you're right. I'm not. Cut the chatter! Everyone, back to work! For a minute there, I almost got to Siggy. I could see it in her eyes. Maybe there is a soft heart inside that cold fish. Careful, Daniel son. Easier to catch fish in calm waters than in stormy sea. What are we gonna do, Mr. Miyagi? We've set the course due east, in the direction we last saw the whale. Uh baffles me is every time I spot her, she vanishes. Just like that. Maybe there's a reason she vanishes. Maybe she knows she's being hunted. Oh, you talk like she had a mind of her own. She's just a hundred tons of blubber. She's more than blubber. Whales are peaceful by nature and closer in intelligence to man than any other creature. <gasps> I'm not that hungry. Sorry. Taki's right. We're not talking about some stupid mackerel here. But if you don't have the stomach for it, stay below. <sighs> I've lost my appetite.
Siggy, relieve Olaf and Whale Watch. Aye, sir. I'll finish this later. <laughs> Landlubbers. Siggy, you've got to convince your father it's wrong to kill the whale. Leave me alone. I've got work to do. <laughs> Some sailor you are. You laugh, but I think you really care about the whale. You're just afraid to admit it. I'm not afraid of anything. I just want to talk, girl to girl. This is the Bonnie Day, 64 latitude, longitude 128. This is a bummer. All right, rock and roll! You helped me to see. Hey, you know, I was just 
calling it like I saw it. There's another side to the whale, too. That's why we came aboard. We've been searching for a lost statue with great powers. Mr. Miyagi thinks it's inside the whale. That's the reason it's acting so insane. I don't know if I understand what you're saying, but I believe you. Ah! Ah! What was that, a storm? That's no storm! It's the fail! I was supposed to be on watch! I've got to find my father! Sidney, wait! You don't have to listen to him! Stand up for what you believe! All hands on deck! Fail on starboard bow! Ready the nets! I'll mend the harpoon! Supposed to be a watch, not having a fancy party. You'll disobey the order, sailor. I'm not just a sailor. I'm your daughter. I have feelings of my own. Siki, think of the reward. It is the answer to our dreams. Your dreams, but about mine. The veil. Siki, help the crew man the nets. No. Mr. Miyagi! 
Shaggy. No one to hurt you, just to make you cough. The reward. I found the daughter. Hey, look! She's come back to say goodbye. Do you think the well really knew she was rescuing us? I'd like to believe she did, Sing. 